Why? Because it says homework. I will break that camera. Hello, everyone. Um, I was just out running some errands. I picked up our fan mail for the week. And William will be reading that uh, tonight or tomorrow, but the video should be released tomorrow. Um, Isaiah Smith, your mail is here. So just so you know, you'll be hearing that in the video that comes out from this. Also, while I was here, I wanted to give you an update on this whole eBay mess. Um, as you know, I ran that auction for a penny. Trollers got a hold of the account and they jacked up the auction all the way up to $90,000. And then the one person was honest and said, I really didn't mean to hit the button for $90,000 and said, can I retract his bid? And I did. So it went down to $85,000. Um, and then I even emailed that person and I said, do you do realize that you're, you're bidding for $85,000? And I said, please let me know now if you made a mistake and I will retract your bid. Well, later on, I believe that person mailed me, emailed me at the very, pretty much to, at the very end of the auction when I wasn't looking at my mail. And then after it went through, he re-emailed me and said, I want to, can I cancel? Well, you know, um, I didn't want to argue with that person. I could have been mean and said no and given him a, him a, him or her a headache for costing me this mess. But I figure that mess that that person put me in is going to, that he put himself in or she, I'm in the same mess too, because eBay is going to think that I just made $85,000. They're going to charge me the fees. I could have to, I might have to pay taxes and I didn't want to go through all that. So to save both that person and I a headache, I canceled it and I relisted the Xbox. Um, I told you William's been kind of calmed down about the whole thing. Um, and he actually thought we were going to get possibly the $85,000 and he was very excited. You know, I, I really didn't think it was going to happen. And I showed him the auction didn't go through and he, he was disappointed. But then he said, Oh, good. Well, now I can keep my Xbox. And I said, No, I'm relisting the item. So that's what I did. The item, it's it's on sale now. Um, It says three hours and six minutes, but it's a little less than three hours as I haven't refresh the screen um, lately. It's a little less than three hours and right now the bid's only at $84 and if anybody places unrealistic bids on here, you know, um, when they sit there and rack up to the thousands, if it's an unrealistic bid and yeah, if it's over 5000 or something, I'm probably just going to retract their bid because I know they're just playing games. But right now it's it's at $84. The auction ends in 2 hours, 52 minutes, 43 seconds. And, uh, you know, I, like I said, William's been calm. He has actually been doing chores. He's been apologizing to me. Um, he's done the dishes. He's done some cooking. He's actually right now cutting the grass. He, he's really bending over backwards. Uh, and I talked to him because you know, I kind of did take his Xbox and I just said, oh, so what do you think we could do with the money? And we might not, we're probably, we might not even get what it's worth, but it's a tough lesson learned. And, uh, he agreed I can take whatever the dishes are worth out of the money. I don't know, 30, 40, $50. I'll take that out. And whatever's left over, I said he can choose to do with what he wants. And what he wants to do is get... Not another Xbox One, but the Xbox One S. And we worked out a deal, and I said, uh, whatever the difference is after the auction, he'll pay half, and I'll pay half. And I am holding on to a little bit of his money as a guarantee that he's going to pay his end. And, well, I did pick it up. And he's outside cutting the grass, and he doesn't know that I got it already. I told him I was going to give it to him tonight, and he doesn't know I came home with it. It's right here. I'm getting ready to, when he's done cutting the grass and he cools off, I'm going to give it to him. And there will be an unboxing coming in just a little bit. Thank you for everybody. 
uh, for your support during this time. And please keep liking and subscribing. And I, I love you guys. Bye. We're doing an unboxing of the new Xbox One S. And William here is going to do the unboxing. All right. Um, just got to pull the thing off. Don't throw it on the floor. This is heaps so hard to get off. All right. Well, uh, why I'm getting this off? It's uh, two terabytes. Okay. Uh, this one actually outputs uh, 4K video, so you can like stream 4K on YouTube and uh, all your apps and stuff. Um, and has a, comes with a vertical stand. You can actually stand it up vertically. This one. And let me open this. All right. So here's the actual console. I'm just like showing off all the Xbox exclusives. I right, got like a little. Oh, it's just instructions, I guess, for the... You can get a close-up on that. Let me... Hold on. Alright. So that's the manual, right? Or that's, whatever. That's for standing it up vertical, I guess. Oh, okay. There's a, no instructions to stand it up vertical? You yeah. need instructions to turn it vertical? Yeah. Okay, right, I'll trust you on, on that. Let it, no, I, you didn't let it... The camera... Okay, let me go down. <laughs> You're so excited. Includes. You gotta wait for. F I'll just have to explain it because you have the box shaking. Right. You're not holding it still. All right. Well, that's. that's if you put I it down, I can do it. All right. So All right. he opened it up. Okay. So here is the. I'm guessing this is a. Um... Oh, okay. This is the. Oh, controller. The controller. Yeah, I like the. I, I do like the white theme. I guess. Okay. I never had a white Xbox before. This one... I like the control. I'm really liking the controller. Got the two batteries here. Is this wireless controller? Or yeah, is... of course. I don't know these things. And then... Alright, and then we got the HDMI cord. For top plugging in. Of course it's 4K. And then I don't know what, if there's anything else in here. Um, oh yeah, there's the plug. In this one, there is no power brick. The power brick is inside the Xbox. The, that was a really annoying thing that they uh, took that they had on the Xbox. power brick. The power brick, like the, the oh the, the thick the thick thing that goes the, outside the, the Xbox. Thing, yeah, outside the Xbox. So it's inside the Xbox. Yes. It's okay, I got you. And we have That's a, a big difference. Oh, there's, uh, I guess it's like a promotions box. Oh, okay, here's the vertical stand. I really don't know. Oh, you need a stand it for it. Yet. Interesting. No, no, you can lay it vertical or you can lay it horizontal. Okay, I don't know these things. And then there's just like the trials and stuff. Okay. Hopefully that didn't show. Right. And then here is the beauty. It is so small. Uh, I think it's like, I might be wrong, it's like 30% lighter and 40% smaller. I know it's 40% smaller, but I don't know about the weight. It feels really light. It's like, like that. Can I it's, try to hold it? Yeah, here. Huh. It's a lot lighter. So it's lighter, smaller, um, two terabytes. Yeah, it's too terrible. Wireless controller. How small this thing is. Like, here's the controller. Here is the controller of the Xbox One. Just for a reference. Wow, it's almost the size it's of the... It's so small. It, they say it's the smallest Xbox One Is ever. it smaller that way? Is it just thinner, or is it smaller in smaller always? always. Okay. It, it's, they say it's the smallest Xbox ever made. Well, the dimensions yeah. are on the box. What? It is a clickable button to turn it on now. And so, so that just a swipe? Yeah, so, like, you... you so I can't come over and just swipe it on you? Yeah. And then the sync button. Darn. There. Of course, you got the back here. Um. Yeah, the power cord. I, I love the. I'm loving Let's the see that back. But you're loving the power cord. Yeah. Love how it's just a power. No power brick. 
Are these different? Are these the same out things were, that were on the other one? All yeah, these I guess that's a um, new like uh, headphone jack. Like camera got cut off. Oh, and also I guess that's like a, just a headphone jack right there. Got the Ethernet cord. All these fancy stuff. Maybe yeah. I'll hold it. Maybe I'll zoom in on it when you're not holding it. I can still not get over the fact of how small it is. That is amazingly small. All right. Well, let me uh, look at the vertical stand here. Okay, so I guess it, um, is it either way? Okay, no, it's just this way. Is it going to um, stand on a bed? Well, you'll find out. I'll put it on the floor. There. Well, alright. It's steady. But I'm not going to be using it vertical. This thing is just amazing. I, uh, I bet you I guess there's really, love it. Um, what is the difference between this and the other Xbox? Besides, you said, uh, what are oh, the main the, differences? The power bricks inside, it's, uh, it's, the, it's much smaller. The, the old Xbox one was huge. Okay. And this, uh, it's 30% lighter. It's really light. It's really, really light. Um, it, it can stream 4K. And the other one couldn't stream 4K? No. Okay. And storage. I think, oh yeah, it's two terabytes. But what's yeah. the other Xbox? One terabyte, uh, or unless you have the five hundred gigabyte model. Okay. And I think that's just about it for this. Let me. Uh, do you mind if I zoom in? Here. For our curious viewers. Oh. <gasps> My bad. Okay, this is the back. Oh. I are, that's infrared out. Did the other one have an infrared? I don't know. I don't even know what that means. Well, they have that on phones uh, for like remote to make, so you can have like a remote control on your phone. That's for internet there. There's these HDMI in, HDMI oh, out. Get, get, get the box so that you can zoom in on that one part. <laughs> <laughs> I think I, it's not doing, oh, it doesn't want to zoom in on the, this, oh, let me go up. There we go. Yeah, man, I think that's. High speed cable. Just about it. Uh, this is what's included in the box. A high speed cable, the Xbox One S console, Xbox One vertical stand, wireless controller with the 3.5 millimeter, millimeter stereo head jack, one year warranty, and of course, wireless network capability pretty obvious and so that is the official unboxing for the Xbox One S yeah I, I don't know if you can tell but this thing is so small I'm I'm still amazed so yep he, supposedly it's a good thing that this is smaller than the original Xbox One. Smaller and more lightweight. Yeah. And I guess that's a convenience thing. Yeah. I guess smaller can be better. Yeah. So I guess William's going to put it together and put this thing to the test. Anything else you want to add to this? No, but I think that sums it all up. All right. Bye. Bye.